In my last video, I talked about Snapchat influencers and their complete vapidness and emptiness. But some people in the comments alerted me that Shane Dawson's Snapchat stories are the worst things possible. So I have to look at them, you know what I mean? But before we get into this video, I want to make a quick disclaimer. Shane Dawson is not a good person. He has done countless like racist weird things online, including pedophilic things. He has said pedophilic things towards Willow Smith and different some other people. And he has also like kissed an underage fan. It was a weird, really weird thing. And on top of all that, his editor for his podcast is a known like Pedophile, allegedly, we was doing that for legal reasons, but most, yeah, it's definitely a pedophile. If you want more information on that, watch that video I made, it, it, it's gross. But now we're gonna make fun of the weird guy, okay? Let's just do it. So something I want you to know real quick is Shane Dawson has 4.9 million subscribers on Snapchat, right? If we look at his most recent video, he put on his spotlight, which is what I think is Snapchat's version of the TikTok scroll feature. If we look at this here, it was posted at least 17 hours ago and only has one comment, which means that even though he has 4.0 million subs on there, ain't nobody checking him out, which is a good thing. We want this motherfucker's career to die. But let's just click on some of these Snapchats and see what is a Shane Dawson up to. It's so beautiful, I don't even want to shove it in my bussy. I can't do this. Jesus Christ. If there's any young, gay, bisexual men out there, just please, for the love of God, do not end up like this, man. I Please, Jesus Christ. Why would he look at a cupcake and be like, I don't want to shove it up my asshole? Why is you thinking about shoving the cupcake up a goddamn asshole? This shit hits harder than my granddaddy while he's doing that, like, I'm not going to do the face because somebody DM me and said, hey, can you send me a picture where you're rolling your eyes and you have your tongue sticked out? They was going to take that picture and come on it. So I will not be doing that face. Thank you very much. But he's doing that face. Why? Jesus Christ, Shane Dawson. <laughs> <laughs> How do you have this much money and no sense of style? That shirt has seen hell. What the fuck? Shane Dawson is someone who his personality just comes through his exterior because he's a disgusting piece of shit on the inside, not on the outside. It's the same! He has cats. Wait, was the cat thing ever real? Did he actually do that? I didn't fuck my cat. I didn't come on my cat. I didn't put my dick anywhere near my cat. I've never done anything weird with my cats. I promised myself I was gonna make an apology video after last year's thing, so I'm trying to be short and honest with this as possible. One slash question mark. It's such a funny tweet, cause like, how many tweets do you need to be like, I didn't have sex with my cat? Comes off as very guilty. I think he did have sex with his cat. I don't like this. I don't like this. It's crazy how one can live a life, be successful somehow, get just always make the wrong decision. There's so much wrong with this. Why is the shirt so stretched out? <laughs> His ass is so fruity. That's some good ass. Trust me, I know good ass. I don't think there's nothing wrong with eating ass. I would love to eat a girl's ass, but I just don't like it when he says it. Let's be real. I feel like a lot of people who make fun of Shane Dawson make fun of him for things they wouldn't make fun of other people for, right? I'll be honest with the audience. I'll be honest with the viewers here. Something about Shane Dawson makes any action, it could be the best action. He could save humanity and I'd be like, that's fucking cringe. Don't do that shit, dude. <laughs> He's like Elon Musk in that way. Everything he does is just so infinitely pathetic and not in a sexy way. Cause there's a pathetic sexy, you know what I mean? You know what I mean. He's not that. That vibes are strong today. I'm gonna be honest, he looks more like the uncle that touched you. Hey, I'm only making that joke because he has been pedophilic in the past. I don't watch Shane Dawson, right? But I'm so convinced that his husband hates him. There is no way. There is no way they have a happy marriage. I hate this picture. Oh my God. Oh my God. Shane, you posted cringe on main. What the fuck? This one has to be self-aware. I mean, a lot of these other ones, I don't think they've been self-aware. This one's definitely self-aware. I read that first as groomer and I didn't even question it. I did, God damn it, dude. Oh, grower, like, like penis. I'm a grower, not a shower. Okay. I didn't want the image of his penis in my head. I'm gonna be honest. I could have lived a long life without that. Jesus Christ, man. What the fuck? Imagine you spend nine months in labor, you know? You spend nine gratuitously long months in labor. You go through pain of childbirth. And then you push out that fucking baby. And it's this grim. What the fuck, man? Here's the biggest example of money don't buy style. Because, man, what the fuck? 
did not I did not want to see that. I did not want to see that shit. Why the fuck did I have to see that shit? How did this man ever get an audience? Cause I'm gonna be so real with you. I never really watched his videos. That wasn't my cup of tea, not my thing. But look at this picture and tell me this man ever had a sense of comedy. He has just proved that the society we live in ain't a fucking meritocracy. Cause like, look at this guy. Look at this guy. He's a millionaire. And in 2017, he got a bunch of kids to believe in 9-11 conspiracy theories. I'm gonna be honest, I don't think I can do this no more. I gotta, I gotta stop. I gotta stop. Oh, Jesus Christ. Yeah, so as someone who ain't really watched his content much, this just makes me question even more how he got the platform he did. Cause he got like 20 million subs or he did. Now he's losing subscribers. Let's go, let's go. The world is healing. Hallelujah. Yeah, I just hope I never have to see nothing like that again. After looking through those, it makes me feel like every single one of his like viewers growing up, every single one of his fans growing up, they all had to have like stunted development because ain't no way that man's enriching the lives of nobody. Anyways, I'm done being a hater. If you like this video, comment down below your thoughts, your opinions. Make sure to like the video. Make sure to subscribe to our post notifications on so you never miss an upload and click that video right there. If you like this video, bye. <laughs>